the financial system. In 1907, financial panic broke out in the United States. The stock market crashed and people stormed the banks. The banker J.P. Morgan brought together the rich elite of America into a single room and forced them to loan money to the banks in order to prevent a collapse of the financial system. 101 years later, nine heads of the largest banks in the United States congregated in a room at the Ministry of Finance and did not exit until they signed their consent to receive a government bailout of 250 billion U.S. dollars. Why is the financial system so important that everything must be done in order to prevent its collapse? The financial system is composed of institutions and markets. Its job is to act as a broker between those who need money or capital and those who have capital. It's responsible for allocating capital in the world. Who has capital? Households, companies, and governments that deposit in banks money that they have saved or that invest money in the capital markets. Who needs capital? Households, companies, and governments need more money than they have for household purchases, recruitment of workers, development, technology, and the building of infrastructures. Brokering is done directly through the purchase of securities, bonds, or shares. Investors basically transfer money to companies or governments, or indirectly to banks and financial institutions, which take deposits and essentially provide loans to whoever needs money. When a company sells shares, it's raising capital for its activities, and in return, it gives investors a stake in its ownership. Shareholders are meant to share in the profits of the company, which they receive as dividend payments. When a company sells bonds, it's lending money. The investor who purchases the bond is a lender, but has no ownership. He's supposed to receive interest payments of the entire loaned sum at the end of the period. An example of allocating capital through bonds is China, which purchases from its export revenues bonds of the United States government, thereby financing it. When we save and invest money, we hope to increase our capital. Pension saving, for instance, is meant to finance our retirement. In exchange for loaning money to someone else, we receive yield and our money grows. Without brokerage, the global financial system would look completely different. The achievements of the financial system are not negligible, and when it failed, the results were catastrophic. In the crisis, panic took over and trust in the financial system was destroyed. The desire to lend money dissipated. Thank you for your time, and we're certain that the more you learn, the more interesting and successful trade will be. You can find additional and more focused courses on trade that teach market basics, models, support and opposition, and more.